Hello everyone, Coloring Cat Mom here. Today we have a flip through of the book Horror and Nightmare Creatures Black Background Dark Fantasy Adult Coloring Book Mosaic Color by Number by Color Questopia. Um, I seen this book while I was uh, perusing on Amazon and I'm a fan of horror and nightmare movies and stuff like that so um, I figured I would give this book a try because, um, the art of Pennywise on the, the cover really caught my attention. So, um, yeah, that's, um, why I chose this book. So let's dive in and see what's in this book, shall we? And this book's a couple years old. It was copyrighted in 2020. Okay. Fun fact, that's the year I got into adult coloring was 2020. That's when I started out. Color by number tips. And as usual, with Color Questopia books, you will have the colored image on the right and the suggested palette on the left. Now keep in mind when doing CBN books like this one that um, you can use other colors than what are suggested. You can do what you want with them still beside, despite being a CBN book. Um, let your imagination run wild um, or follow the suggested um, colors. Either way, there's no wrong way to color this book. Oh wow, and like an Annabelle image. A vampire. A woman screaming. A clown. Wow. It's a gory looking guy. I've seen this image colored a few times. Once by following a color palette and once by not following it. In both ways, this image did look awesome. And then this one. Skull guy. In someone's hand. So my thoughts so far are I like this book. Um, there are a ver variety of mediums that I could use for this book, which I like. Um, the book looks easy enough to color, and it's not it doesn't have too too big of the spaces, nor does it require a lot of skill to color this book which is great because sometimes I, I like just an eat to sit down and color and and it be an easy book to color. <clears throat> Let me know what you think in the comments. I know Halloween is coming up and I'm trying to get squeeze in the last few Halloween type books that I can on the channel before then so that way I can start with autumn and Christmas I like that and that's the end of the book but let's look at the bonus images and see what they put included in here Halloween horror uh, Personally, I'm not a fan of the white line versions. To me, I feel like it might be a little hard to color. Plus, it'd be a little tedious having to color the black lines, but color in the lines. And I just feel that black line versions are better and easier to color. But that's my preference. You may prefer white lines. 
that that's just not me which fantasy now if these books are available in black line version i would definitely definitely look into getting them but if they're not then it's just not my cup of tea they look very very hard to color but some people like the white line version and some people prefer the black line version so it's all it's all up to you shark Cactus and Succulent Coloring Book. Beautiful images, just not something that I would probably color. Leave us a review on Amazon, which I will be doing. And here is the suggested color key that they suggest you use for the book. Again, like I said previously in this video, you do not have to do that. You can use any colors that you want. It doesn't matter. Um, you can use your imagination and let your imagination run wild. It's, it's however you want to do it. There's no right or wrong way to color a CBN. Again, this book is called Horror and Nightmare Creatures, Black Background, Dark Fantasy, Adult Coloring Book, Mosaic Color by Number by Color Questopia. <clears throat> it's available for sale on Amazon. There will be a link in the description to purchase it if you want to purchase a copy for yourself. Um, as always, if you like this video, hit like. If you're a first time viewer or haven't subscribed yet, please do. Um, that will greatly help me out so much. Um, if you want to follow me on my social medias, you can follow me on Facebook at The Coloring Cat Mom. My Facebook group, The Coloring Cat Mom. Or on Instagram at The Coloring Cat Mom. Either way, I would love to have you as a follower and as a friend. Um, stay tuned. Um, there will be more content posted in the next few days. Um... Um, a lot of content. I'm going to be flooding YouTube with content in the next few days. So keep an eye out for it. Um, I'll post on social media and alerting you to new content as I always do. But, um, yes, um, please stay safe, my friends, and, um, I will have more content for you soon. Take care. Bye now.